The high-end sneaker and clothing store in East Point is back open after a violent break-in at the end of last year. Take a look at the surveillance video from the store owners. It shows the thieves using a car and then a sledgehammer to break inside. Fox 5's Eric Mock is live for us in East Point. Eric, what a comeback and what co that's amazing surveillance video there. Yeah, Eric, it really is. And you can really see why when you look at that surveillance video. Let's check that out right now again for you. You can see right off the bat, they're using a car to try to break into the front of the store. And then when that doesn't work, they grab sledgehammers and break down the door to get inside. That's when they then grab all the clothes they can carry and get out of the store. Now, for some biz small businesses, that would be enough to end them. But that's not the case here at Refresh Atlanta today. They are back open here. And as you can see, they've got all their merchandise out. And now I'm joined live here by the store's owners. We got Baldwin Dawkins here and Richard Brown. Guys, thank you so much for joining us here. First off, just tell us about Refresh. What do you guys sell here? We sell um, sneakers. We buy sell trade sneakers here. Jordans, Yeezys, um, Hell Store, Gallery Depot, all the stuff that everybody really, really wants. <laughs> <laughs> and you guys have your own clothing line too, right? Yes, yeah, it's called Deadly Bread, and we're based out of Pittsburgh, PA. And we, we, we really like everyone to shop with us. Yeah, and you can see they're showing it off right here, guys. They got the merchandise on. Um, now, let me ask you, obviously, financially, it takes a lot to recover from something like this, but how do you mentally and emotionally recover from something like this to your store? Stand disciplined, stand with your loved ones, believing and being persistent, keeping it focused, and just make sure you get up and keep going. Now, I know you guys told me earlier you want to inspire people through this as well. You know, it's not just a success story for you financially. What are you hoping people take away from this? What's the message you want to get out to the community? That you, you, don't, you don't have to uh, give up. You can keep get up and keep moving. Make sure that you strive for greatness and that we're here to help whoever. You know, we don't, we don't, somebody had to forgive us and we forgive everybody. As long as you come and show us that you want to be better in life, we're here to help and push that narrative. And you guys also said that you as young entrepreneurs, you want to help other people become entrepreneurs here, right here in Atlanta and in the East Point community, right? Yes, we do. We, um, we offer mentorships here also. So if any kids, you know, high school, middle school would like to come through and, you know, do an internship, we offer that. So we mentor um, for credit, business credit, um, teach people about loans and how to use other people's money. Things like that. Yeah. All stuff you need to know, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, the, guys, such an inspiring story. Thank you so much. So not only can you get some really great merchandise, but you can also get inspired to start your own business. We'll have more on this coming up tonight at 10 and 11. But for now, reporting live in East Point, Eric Mock, Fox 5 News. All right, Eric, size 11 if you want to bring anything back. Thanks so much.